But I knew I had to take a break. I knew it because I got to the point where I wasn't sure if I knew who I was when there wasn't a screen in front of my face. You know? Because I know it sounds bad to say, but there's an online me and there's an in-person me. And I know it sounds fake to say that, but it's true, you know? And I'm scared that the online version is better. <laughs> I am, because online, I try, to, I try to educate people, you know? I, I, I take up for people that I don't know. I fight for causes that I believe in. But in real life, I saw my friend Sean get jumped and I was like, he probably did something. Uh, <laughs> I don't see how that's my business, you know? <laughs> Honestly, it wouldn't be three of them if he didn't do it, if he didn't deserve it, you know? In fact, let me turn around. I don't like him screaming my name like that. That's, I don't wanna be involved. <laughs> Online, I try to educate people that I feel like are being ignorant. But you know what I don't do in real life? Read, like, I don't know where I get off talking down to people. <laughs> because I got a keyboard in front of me. <laughs> Online, I tell people I don't know to keep following their dream. I tell them that they can do it. I don't know if they can do it. I keep telling them <laughs> that they can do it. And in real life, I gave a street performer money to stop. <laughs> I was online. And I saw this guy making fun of this kid for being too skinny because he posted a workout video and there was this big dude making fun of him, right? And so I told him, hey, if you want to get your ass beat, come to this address. <laughs> and in real life, I gave him my buddy Sean's address. You know what I mean? Like, how was I supposed to know he was gonna be two other people? That's just unfair. 